esta entrevista se acabó. My next uh, beautiful guest is uh, Little Red Bunny. Hi, How are you doing? Hi, I'm here before I knew it. <laughs> hi, hi. I'm here, I'm here. Yes, you have been busy in the chat, I see. That's awesome. Always busy. I'm a busy bunny. I should be a busy bee, but I'm a bunny. You're the bunny. You have uh, stuck with this name for a very long time. You're the most awarded uh, cam model, at least that I can find and know of. And uh, now you're giving a lot of things back to the industry, uh, both with your academy. Let's start with your academy and, and talk us through that one first. <clears throat> well, yes, I've been uh, totally in the shadow. I was actually an underdog. And um, I was not totally fitting the trend anywhere on any sites, but I kept doing the things I like and I grew my style and my approach. Um, and it led me to all these awards. I, I worked five years being the underdog and nobody knew about me. I mean, online people knew me, but but kind of like you always look at lovers and haters. And yeah. Yeah. eventually, yeah, I won the awards and then another one, another one while people were laughing at me listening to my old music and all that stuff like you're gonna be <laughs> yes. such a failure and ha 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 you with your old like clothes you just have old man man coming to you anyway no matter what i made it and it's 100%. been now 11 years and um i did won uh 18 awards i believe so far uh yeah. but to me, the most of it, like what pays more than, I mean, every award have a special um, place in my heart. They all have a specific reason and they all mean a lot to me. And, but more than anything, it's like even every day when I'm online, I have models even coming in my room to say hi or saying, I'm having a coffee before going online. I just have to see you to get in the mood. <laughs> or I'm having a break and I'm coming to see you because you cheer me up because I'm the nice bins and hard so, so far and you're going to cheer me up. And these things like mean a lot because it's instant. It's without yeah. having a selfie to promote that they met me or they don't ask anything in return. They're just happy to see me. And this means so much to me. You have this academy and it's successful and it's a pretty good product out there for, for people to be interested in and contact you about that. But you also do this beautiful thing for the industry. You have your survey that you try to do now. I think you have it yearly, right? The, the, this year will be the third time? Uh, to, no, this year is the second time. And because the, because time, the pandemic going on, I extend it on until it was supposed to end on April 15. I extended a month extra, at least so far. Yeah. I don't think I'll extend more than that. I understand uh, people are trying to adjust with a different lifestyle. And mm. I mean, it's so I don't know how it's going to go this year. The first year was uh, breaking the ice. Um, the survey mm. was twice as long as it is now. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for everyone that filled the survey back then. You need to test it out. Yeah, it was yeah, about 20, 30 minutes. It now it's about more like 10, 15 minutes of your time. Awesome. Um, my goal behind that is that I realized a lot of, there was a lot of preconception of the industry, even within the industry. And people stating mm -hmm. facts when it's not factual. And I want to break down all these assumptions and try to really end speculations and try to have real facts of what the industry is about, what the reality of the model is about, uh, the pro and the cons, because you have to acknowledge yeah. uh, what is missing or what is needed in order to then change things, uh, give hints for platforms, companies surrounding like the toys or the services company that pro provide websites or new upcoming platforms. Like that.